As you know, I'm from Brownsville in Brooklyn, but I'm sure after the day, for one day only, they're going to call it Orangeville or something. <laughs> I'm with them, I fucking might just take issue with this. What about New Jersey? They fucking forget about us all the fucking time. We got the orange fucking sky too. I gotta agree with what Tony says. They got it bad. It's bad in New York. Don't go outside. Stay the fuck inside. It's a very uh, unfamiliar New York. I don't know what to fucking think, huh? I got a, a baby running around. I don't, I don't know what to fucking do. Somebody tell me what to do. What the fuck am I seeing right now? What the fuck is all of this? What am I in a fucking Blade Runner movie? What the fuck is this? I don't know what the fuck is happening here. Man, let me tell you something. It's like those Canadian Wi-Fi's. Are like, it's like they're using a the mobile phone, filling with the filters, and, and putting some mad filter on New York City, man. This gets crazy shit. <laughs> I remember when I went off the boat as a young kid. And I saw New York City exactly like that. Orange, it was beautiful. Something about it. Okay, that's right. I am a New Yorker, too. I ain't never seen New York City like that in my entire life. Hmm? But that's why you gotta, you gotta embrace the changes. Hmm? It's gonna be like this for a few days. You gotta stop complaining, okay? Weekend, it's gonna be all right. Okay. <laughs> my man. I was once dubbed the king of New York City. So I say to all the citizens, don't panic. It'll pass by the weekend. You know what? It's an orange wrath of fury. And you know what? It's, it's symbolism because New York turned its back on me. And now it's all orange. It's all orange. And that's what I call revenge. Okay? <laughs>